Students of the University of Joss are lamenting the over 155% increment in school fees by the management of the institution. The university management had on Saturday released a new school fee schedule for fresh and returning students, a development that many parents and students say is uncalled for. Adam Musa completes the report. The approved new charges for the 2022 academic session indicates that fresh students will pay 213,000 naira, while returning students will pay 160,000 naira. Last session, both fresh and returning students pay 45,000 naira each. However, the students say the new charges are too high for parents considering the economic hardship in the country. Because the increment is very high, is very high, is very high, in the sense that a lot of us cannot accommodate such. I, uh, we interact within us, we know our capacity and, um, and seriously, the, 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 way, the way how the country is going, I don't think if most of us will come back to the school and continue with our program. I don't think so. Honestly, like every other Nigerians, is very outrageous. Like I keep telling people, people, people most of us here, uh, we are students and we are fathers. We, are, we have children also who, are, who are also in school. We have our wives who are also in school. We have our dependents who, uh, dependents who depend on us for, for their schooling. So now increasing the school fees to this kind of uh, amount is so outrageous. I have heard that University of Jos have increased their school fees and it's not nice at all because some people are coming here because they cannot afford private university. Are they trying to compare themselves to private universities? Some of us came here because we will not be able to afford it at all. 200,000 is too much. The student, however, called on the federal government and the university authority to look into the current economic hardship and review the charges downward. Um, I'm calling on the relevant authorities to look at us most especially with the masses because if you look at the institutions majority of us are coming from the poorest family so uh, battling with what we eat now is a, is a problem talk more of paying school fees and we call on relevant authorities if actually the federal government has said that this increment are, 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 are children hold water they should monitor they should set up a monitoring, monitoring team or committee to go to the, all these different schools because they're trying to exploit some students as, as our president used to say, that let the poor man, let the poor breathe. Honestly, let us breathe because there are some poor masses who cannot be able to pay this kind of school fees. If not, we have got to private school, private universities and school. For the government to look into it and reduce the price of the school fees, because learning is not only for the rich. Even us that are poor, we are supposed to learn. President Bola Tinubu had in his nationwide broadcast on Monday asked high institutions, especially universities, to avoid arbitrary increment of school fees in order to ensure that students continue with their education. Adomusa, Trust TV News, just.